I didn't even know that I was not meeting or rising to the occasion because I didn't truly understand or grasp what uh, my job was supposed to be as a manager. Right. Um, but I definitely feel as if the course has helped me to understand what's expected of me and really um, what I should be doing in that role. You know, it's just being titled general, general manager is not enough. It comes with some some actual responsibility and tracking and analytics. I'd never even considered right. uh, tracking. And I think that was one of the big things is you can't manage what you're not tracking. You're not, you know, keeping right. writing down on paper or looking at the hard numbers. Um, that's just exciting. That's just exciting to me. And my biggest frustration, and I didn't know it until I took the course, was I didn't know what a manager was supposed to do. The week one was – Oh, like that, just that realization, like that's, that's what a manager is supposed to do. Like I'm building competency and I'm building productivity in the employees and in team members. My idea of management was, uh, I just thought everybody knew what needed to happen. I shouldn't have to tell anybody anything. We're all, we all understand the goal and we're all working towards the goal. And what I've learned through the management is in large part, uh, I'm the goal setter and, and really the, I'd say the spark behind keeping those goals up front, making sure the competency levels at where it needs to be to, to meet these goals, making sure we're staying on track with our production to meet these goals. And um, instead of being more like a, a wishful thinker, hmm. like I just hope this is going to get done on time. I've seen a, a transition now into where we're just 10 weeks in. It's the transition to um, setting that 90-day plan, working back, and then knowing like, Today, I could sit down with the team and say whether we're on track or whether we're behind. It's asking a lot of the other guys to evolve with you in their thinking and, and who you are to the company. So it's like as you grow and you change, you're expecting people to uh, – it's kind of like we expect them not to view us any differently, but we definitely want them to view us differently. And it's yeah, asking right. a lot of our – it's asking right. a lot of the team members <laughs> to, to do that. And so there's been – even that's a process of learning, like, how can I relate and uh, still be friendly with the team members? Because, I'm, you know, in my role, I'm, I'm still production. Uh, that's, I'm, I'm out there producing cabinetry every day and having to support finishing. You know, we have a guy that does the majority of all the finishing. Yeah. Uh, so it's fitting into that production process and being a part of the team while managing the team. 